What's up, people? Welcome back to another live reaction of Bleach. This is 253. Let's go and get this episode started. So, last episode we had Biakia vs. Uh, Kowa. Kowa. Well, there's one thing I misunderstood about him. I thought he was honestly the father. But there's a possibility that he is not because he's supposed to marry. Uh, Biakia's mother but then he went rogue before that right so I guess he's probably not the father I don't know we might actually get to see the end of it and also they brought up this new interesting thing that Shinigami themselves having a certain ability I mean like the the first part soon as you press the play button the um, the the guy who speaks it's clearly state the Shinigami Sambato is inspired by the Shinigami which is understandable but then why is like that Shinigami having his power without his Sambato that's kind of you know it doesn't fit right in to the whole story I know it's a filler but still Because Muramasa's power is able to, you know, control it, but then this guy's power is almost like Aizen is, you know, illusion. But then he's fighting without Sambaktu. So I'm looking forward to seeing this episode, but I'm not gonna take that power thing. Like for example, when he said, "I have a power," my it's uh, Muramasa's power came from me which is understandable but then he don't have any power that's the problem right if you understand he doesn't have any superpower all right okay this is where Uchigo and Rukia is fighting okay so these are all the bodies he ate Okay, so he's not dead yet. Again, he's bleeding. Damn. Uh oh, more hollows coming out. This is bad. Yet Koha just Man, this is bad. Look at the amount of hollows. Wait, are they going back? No, no, they are actually coming out. Oh, okay, it's actually coming from Hekomondo into here. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be enough. We need Ishida. Exactly, because Ishida's power will be really, really useful here. Yep. <laughs> like bug spray. Yeah, watch. After Byakuya defeat Koga, you know we're gonna go and heal him. Good job. For once. Anyway, uh, let's see. I think you should defeat him. Oh, wait. Did he just disappear? Uh-oh. 
this is bad it's almost like a concentrated power okay did we get the end of this battle oi okay this is like a typical bleach style ending okay I think Muramesa should come oh wait okay no never mind he still haven't accepted the defeat yet now he is begging for Muramesa and I bet that guy will still show up he probably he probably can't hear you at this point or he's gonna come in like a darker version Weak hearted man. Okay. So he's sucking all those Zambaktus in. I wonder if he's gonna be the final villain. Koka is just a, you know, obstruction in the way. Huh. I didn't know Gillian's had legs. Look at the size of one Gillian. Yikes, this is bad. And again, this is happening in the water, so I wonder if this is they're gonna have a reun reunion and then fight at their full strength, or if that's just gonna be. Wait. Uh oh. That's clearly Moramesa, but he turned into a hollow. Sometimes things just doesn't work out the way you want it to work out, so... But I guess Muramasa can't move on because this is his goal, right? He's just gonna attack indiscriminately.
Oh, did he just give up? So that's the calm before the madness. Okay, he's actually going for Ichigo. This is going to be interesting. Wow, he dodged them with no effort. In a way, shield. Don't tell me, Ishida just got taken down. Whoa! The shield actually got stabbed. Wait, I thought he got stabbed, but I guess it was side of the shield. so much pain okay uh oh he's releasing zero just like that and he was actually aiming it in a way and Oh damn, I like that. I like that trans transformation. Inoue and Rukia. It's going at me. Inoue and Rukia. Let's see. Biakia? Yeah. Because since Rukia is there, it would be make sense for Biakia to serve them. <laughs> Wait, is he isn't he getting too tall now? Oh damn. Wow, okay, you can see the hollow, it's just coming in and out. He is listening. Surprisingly, hate to admit, but you know it's right at this point. Okay, what is that noise behind? do you plan on doing? No, don't let your heart guard down. Exactly. Okay, she responded quickly. 
but Sivor was able to shatter the shield. Interesting. Well, technically, by cutting Muramesa in his hollow form, that should clean his soul and send it to soul society, right? But he is not actual soul, so I don't know if how that's gonna work out. And we can't get this too, you know, complicated because at the end of the day, it's a filler. Damn. Direct hit. Hopefully did some damage. And he used the mast. Whoa. That's a bit too OP, isn't it? Okay, is he releasing all the hollows or what's happening? Okay, yeah, he's releasing ho the hollows and is he gonna what? Make a blast? Wait, they're all actually going toward him, okay. Dude, it's like a large, large size cannon. I wonder how many he can fire all at once. What's Inoue doing? <laughs> Two OP people. Okay, what is Muramasa trying to do? Damn, it seems like he that was an effect end of the day. But what was he trying to do? Wow. Okay, what now? He became something weird. What is that? He's obviously not dead, but... What's happening? I need a filter system where I can just block out in a way. So that's basically like a nest 
four hollows. And you can see a lot of them are actually just okay these guys are releasing zero like nothing. Bye bye. <laughs> Oi. Damn. What the hell happened now? Okay. How? Oh, damn. Okay, so it seems like these guys made it out. And we are <laughs> we are actually using the you know some bug to human well physical form it's actually look badass okay to be continued so it seems like the end battle is gonna be against Moromesa I think he is not dead at this point he's just sealed within that egg half egg sort of thing basically that nest so for now we're gonna see these guys fight the hollows and I'm not sure how we're gonna end this though because I don't think you can serve Moramesa without the user but I'm, I don't know if there's any other way to go about this so I'm looking forward to it overall a good stuff and again Byakuya getting a lot of highlights in this one and Ichigo just got absorbed in there probably he's fighting with Moramesa inside who knows well Moramesa's hollow but I don't know uh, Koga is down for good I think I think he did fall into the water I'm not sure if there's any more to him but yeah we'll see I wonder if there will be a re reunion with uh, Koga and Moramesa that would be also interesting okay let's see he did call for Moramesa after he got defeated he apparently realized he need Moramesa an idiot you know even I wouldn't call eyes an idiot because he, he have a similar power but he was able to pull up to a certain point but here this guy just got too cocky <laughs> okay Wait, you can't tell them differently? Anyway, overall, a good episode. I liked it. Let me know what you guys think about this episode in the comment section. Uh, I'm looking forward to the next episode, especially all of this manifested Sampak 2 fighting together with their uh, host. Uh, it's, it will be interesting to see. Anyway, thank you so much for watching with me guys. Hope you enjoyed the reaction. If you did, do give a thumbs up. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe and the bell symbol to get notification of the next video. Have a wonderful day or night people and see you guys with more videos.